because the machine has learned a, a multi-dimensional non-linear relationship, which is what we call a profile. Uh, we also learn networks and connections. So we actually learn the social network of the trader in terms of who are they talking to, what is the nature of the discussion, what is the kind of transactions they're doing. And finally, we learn similar profiles uh, you know, so if some risk traders' profile is particularly interesting from a risk perspective, you can actually see who are their nearest neighbors. So now I'm going to show you the demo, and it's just a video of about 30 seconds, and with that, I guess my presentation will come to an end. So you can see there's a heat map. This is a typical view. It's quite complex. You see lots of reds. These are your risk, uh, you know, risk scores. But this is where the AI kicks in. Uh, not this, but you can look at. Yeah, the behavioral change. So you can see that if someone's behavior is shifting from one profile to another over time, and the machine's learning this continuously, it is something that compliance managers should take note of. Uh, this is where you see the social networks and connections. This is very powerful because we're using a combination of unstructured and structured data. And finally, it learns who are the nearest neighbors to a particular profile. This is very powerful, too, because if you have cases which you know uh, from your history or you know, a Nick Leeson profile, you can actually create one of those and see how your traders are actually getting closer to those risk profiles. Right? So, so that brings me to the end of my talk. Thank you very much. We're very happy to talk to you afterwards. Thanks.